can you realise? I don't know if it's even reasonable to say such a question, but do you realise? Well, the most outstanding thing that's happened to me in my life is that both sons have rescued me. The first, the eldest son, rescued me when the ladder slipped on a roof in the snow, landed on a, a steel cross um, effluent pipe on the house, and it was made of steel, not plastic. It held the ladder. My son, who was on the roof of the extension next to me, reached down from the roof with his arm, grabbed me and pulled me onto the roof safely. Do you see God and Son rescued me in that physical situation? And in the second son, um, my wife having gone and I was homeless, took me in and I occupied his living room for the best part of five years with him and his partner who had the rest of the house, of course. Do you see, he rescued me spiritually. His dad. And God did through him, of course. I felt in both cases this was somehow the epitome of all that one could ever treasure in one's child, that they had the goodwill to rescue their dad. And dare I say this now, you and I are the rescue of our Heavenly Father. All of us, this vast company of his children, we are his rescue which he has brought about, of course, because he's creator of all. We rescue him from loneliness and isolation. We rescue him into the perfect fellowship that he's made, his heavenly host in heaven. We are the rescue. He's made us to be his focus of his gratitude. Isn't that just wonderful? Isn't that just staggering? I don't know quite how to Elaborate on this. We are his joy. He's made us so. He's made us faithful and true to him. What a lovely dad. Love you, dad. We all love you, Dad. And so, you see, in my dream, I put it in this, I don't know, new age way in some sense, but that my superconscious presses upon me to be reconciled with Dad, to rescue him in his battle in his need. A wonderful life eternal. I'm not sure what all this means, but that it's something wonderful, of course. Just what you do.
expect of an awesomely wonderful dad. Thank you, dad.